What's up everyone? It's Bobby with Cigar Cognoscente. Today I'm going to do a uh, review on the Bone Shaker. I was lucky enough for JR's to send me some uh, exclusive cigars uh, that they carry. This one happens to be made by uh, Omar Ortiz. Um, I believe it's got a uh, Connecticut Broadleaf wrap and it's got uh, Nicaraguan uh, Esteli binder and filler. So I'm going to give it a shot today. And this is going to be one of my first cigar reviews. Give it a good little cut. I think the size is actually called a Morning Star. It's a great little smoke. It's probably, I would say, probably about a 45 minute to an hour long smoke. I'm doing the uh, cigar review inside today because it's a little windy out. So I'm doing this out of the garage. On a nice day, I'll probably do it outside when it's not so breezy where you can actually hear me. Let me give this a light and see what I think here. You gotta make sure you got these things lit up good or else they'll start burning crooked on you. Yeah, it's almost there. This torch is taking care of it pretty good. I'm not going to do all this review in one clip. I'm going to do it in probably two clips. Because I'm not going to sit here for an hour and just film myself smoking. But let me get an exhale off this thing and I'll tell you what I'm thinking so far. It's got a really strong nose exhale. Uh, reminds me a lot of a lot of Omar Ortiz's product. I'm getting an espresso taste, kind of like a uh, real earthy, chocolatey taste as well. It'll be interesting to see uh, how this cigar progresses. Um, I'm really hoping it's going to be good. I'm pretty sure it's going to be damn good, really. Um, so I will be getting back to you guys here shortly with uh, the second part of this review once I get at least halfway through it. And I'll let you know what I'm thinking so far. But right now it's tasting pretty promising. I may have to snip it a little bit right here at the top. Um, it's a little snug draw right now. But other than that, the taste is incredible. So I will be getting back with you guys here shortly. And stay tuned. Talk to you soon. Alright guys, I'm back. Probably about 30 minutes into the smoke wasn't a very big cigar so it won't last that long really it is fairly slow burning for you know being a short cigar overall it's been really good uh, it's very consistent the burn as you can see has been straight through all the way and I'm still getting the espresso I'm still getting a little bit of a woodsy taste and the nose exhale is still very strong uh, for the price point of these cigars, they're probably $69.95, I think, at JR's right now for a box. It's really hard to beat that price, and I think you can probably buy them in singles for $5 or so a stick. Um, but I would give this cigar on a rating of 0 to 10. For the price point, I would definitely give it at least an 8. So go ahead down to JR's. Or click on my links through my website. It'll take you directly to the product. Pick yourself up some. It's an awesome cigar for the price. And take my word for it. I've been smoking cigars for probably 11 years. This is a great stick. Look forward to the next cigar review I'm doing. Um, I think I'm going to try the bone. Uh, well, I'm trying the bone shaker now. I think I'm going to try the... Uh, uh, JR sent me some more sticks. I may try the um, the new Witch Doctor by AJ Fernandez next. It's not sure, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. There's quite a few good sticks they threw in the mix for me. Um, so it's going to be one of them. I need a strong cigar to complement this one because if I try a milder cigar, I'm not going to be able to taste it. So I've heard that the Witch Doctor is really strong. Uh, so I probably will do that one next. So stay tuned. Next video coming up after this one is probably most likely going to be The Witch Doctor. Look forward to my next video. Talk to you soon.